in Bangalore city I have seen everywhere the government contractors uh, they were burning plastic on the roads and everywhere and even the corporator of our area he is having a big industry of plastic they were burning so in my area and everybody complained me regarding the pollution because lot of people even my wife was also having a breathing problem lot of asthmatic people are also a problem so then I have taken action uh, against the government official against the health inspector and BBMP people uh, and I am forced them to take action against the government contractors not to burn plastic on the roads and openly and uh, in my area it's sort a big problem ozone and shoba apartment and all they were suffering lot this uh, breathing problem and all and I have taken action against the corporator also because it was his place only where this burning is going on and it was like a but I got success in this and the government has given a good response. Uh, one in some cases these are rag pickers, in others they are garbage contractors who are said to be doing this. Garbage disposal or solid waste management has been an issue for the past few years in Bengaluru and it's getting manifested into different problems, especially for people staying on the outskirts of the city, whether it's Sarchapur Road where we are right now or Whitefield burning of garbage by private individuals as well as some municipal workers in some cases have been rampant leading to a lot of pollution. We are currently ah, on the, the, the Harlu Road near Sarjapur and as you can clearly see it's a private plot where a lot of garbage is being burned on a daily basis leading to a lot of pollution. If you look around there are several apartments most of them have already been occupied others coming up and residents here say that uh, although the situation is not Visibly as bad as Delhi, they are facing several respiratory issues because of this and they have been trying to approach the pollution control board, the municipal body, the local police, but they have been of very little help. Well, fighting this entire crusade is uh, Mr. Ashutosh who has approached several of these authorities who stays in the near neighborhood, who wants his neighborhood to be clean and where he can breathe fresh air, at least not toxic air. This issue has been going on everywhere, especially in the outskirts of the city. You've seen it happening in Kaglipura near Kanakpura Road, Whitefield, Sarjapura. It's the same case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this has been going on since last three years. And I have approached all the government officials and all. But these people are mighty people, you know. They never came. They never came. Two days back, a very good inspector, Mr. Victor, I told him, I know him also personally. So he has taken some action. But uh, one or two days they will stop and again they will stop. Now how is your quality of life getting affected because of this? See in the morning if you see, see such a big lake, Kaswan Ali Lake, here people come out here in the morning walk to become healthy and to breathe a fresh air. But what they are getting this polluted air. A lot of people are suffering from this, you know. My wife is having a respiratory problem because there's a plastic burning, you know. It creates cancer, so many diseases, you know it. So we are fighting for this and I'm very thankful to you that you have come here. Absolutely. Uh, if you look at the kind of garbage that's here, it's largely plastic that's being burned haphazardly and also these are private individuals who are doing it without absolutely any crackdown by the municipality or the pollution control board, making life really difficult for the residents of the area. This is another ugly case of the larger garbage problem that the landlord is facing. इसको भी देखा है मैंने जलाते हुए ये आदमी को भी ये हेल्थ इंस्पेक्टर है इनसे बात करो सर आप हेल्थ इंस्पेक्टर हो ना यहाँ क्या एक्शन फाइव डेज से ऐसा हो रहा है क्या एक्शन ले रहे हैं आप हैं इससे क्या होता है नहीं नहीं यही है साला बदमाश पाओ इधर पैंचो ओनली भी Today is World Environment Day against the plastic pollution and all over the world people are fighting against it. It's my request you just simply don't sit in a home and watch all this, what is going on. Take action, join this movement, fight against plastic, plastic uh, pollution for our future generation to survive. Thank you very much.